Once again, good morning. Welcome for today's turnover ceremony on this 9th day of July, year 2023, here at Northern Police District Headquarters, Kalookan City. To start with, magsitayo po tayong lahat para sa pabansang awit ng Pilipinas. Please remain standing for the invocation to be officiated by Reverend Father the Little Pingol of Parish Holy Trinity, Kalaokan City. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Almighty God, I pray this morning for all the people who graciously attended this turnover ceremony and for the entire nation. May your spirit of guidance continue to, to unite us as one in the spirit in the goodness of service and camaraderie. Sustain us in our good work. Encourage us and grant us safety in every peril. Give us the strength for our labors to endure and wisdom to carry on. Republic of the Philippines, National Police Commission, National Headquarters, Philippine National Police, Camp Brigadier General Rafael B. Crame, Quezon City. Termination of designation. Pursuant to paragraph 2, General Orders Number, NHQ-GO-PBS-2023-3150, dated July 17, 2023. The designation of Police Brigadier General Ponce Rogerio Ibasco Peñones Jr., O-07480, as District Director, Northern Police District, National Capital Region Police Office, Philippine National Police, is terminated effective July 18, 2023. Designation, pursuant to paragraph 1, General Orders Number, NHQ-GO-DES-2023-3152, dated July 17, 2023. Police Brigadier General Rizalito Guerrero Capas, O-10552, is designated as Acting District Director, National Northern Police District, National Capital Region Police Office, Philippine National Police, effective July 18, 2023. By command of Police General Acorda Jr., official, Emmanuel Paloloy Peralta, Police Major General, the Acting Chief of Directorial Staff, signed Robert Teron Rodriguez, Police Major General, the Director for Personnel and Records Management. Thank you very much, sir. Moving on, to give us a message and a relinquishment of office, we would like to request our outgoing district director, Brigadier General Ponce Rogelio Ibasco Pinones, Jr., sir. Good morning, everyone. Allow me first to greet our guest of honor speaker and the presiding officer, the Acting Regional Director of the NCRPO, Police Brigadier General Jose Melencio C. Nartantes Jr. Sir, palapakan natin siya. And of course, the uh, the uh, 
Incoming, District Director of NCRPO, my classmate, fellow sub trooper, my kababayan, Police Brigadier General Rizalito Gapas. Of course, to the uh, mayor, ever supportive mayor of Malabon City, Mayor Jenny Sandoval. Other senior officers who are here, PNCOs, NUPs, other guests, ladies and gentlemen, good morning. Awesome to know, boys. Pursuant to paragraph 1 general orders number NSQ dash GO dash DES dash 2023-3152, National Headquarters for the National Police dated July 17, 2023. I hereby assume the position as Acting District Director, Northern Police District, National Capital Region, Police Office, Philippine National Police, effective July 18, 2023. And I sign. Thank you very much, sir. And we would like to request our operational director, our presiding officer, Brigadier General Jose Valencia Corpus Nardatis Jr., sir, for the turnover of office symbol and property book. Sir, I now hand over the symbol, the symbol of authority. Thank you very much, sir. And another warm round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. Mayor of Malubun City. Hello, everyone. I would like to greet General Jose Melencio Natates, Acting Regional Director at CRPO. Outgoing District Director, General Jose Rogelio Pañones Jr. Incoming General Incoming District Director General Rizalito Gapas, Senior Officers, sa lahat po ng kapulisan, sa lahat po ng didito ngayon para na ito. Distinguished guests, members of the Philippine National Police and fellow citizens, good morning to all of you. Today, we gather here to witness a significant moment in the Northern Police District of PNP National Capital Region. We are here to bid farewell to an esteemed leader and welcome a new torchbearer of our commitment to uphold the ideals of to serve and protect. It's my honor to address you all as City Mayor of Malabon and extend my heartfelt gratitude to each one of you for being a part of this momentous occasion. First and foremost, I would like to express my sincere appreciation to 
to outgoing Director Brigadier General Ponce Rogelio Peñones for his unwavering dedication, remarkable leadership, and countless contributions to Northern Police District. Under his guidance, the District has witnessed remarkable stride in maintaining law and order, fostering community partnerships, and ensuring the safety and security of our residents. General Peñones, your commitment to the principles of public service has undoubtedly left a mark on our constituents. We are, we are grateful for your tireless efforts and steadfast commitment to the duty. As we bid farewell to General Peñones, we warmly welcome incoming Director Brigadier General Rizalito Gapas. With an illustrious career spanning years of exemplary service, General Gapas brings with him a wealth of experience, profound dedication, and a strong sense of responsibility to serve and protect our community. His appointment as the new leader of the Northern Police District signifies our collective belief in his abilities to carry forward the legacy of excellence and uphold the trust placed in him by the Philippine National Police. It is vital for us to acknowledge the significance of the theme that unites us all to serve and protect. These words are not just a mere motto. They encompass the very essence of our noble profession. Basically, scheduled at 8 a.m., but uh, I prefer it sa hapon lang sana, but then uh, gusto nang umalis ang ating uh, Northern Police District uh, outgoing Director General Pinoes, uh, kaya pinaagahan natin. Just kidding aside, sabi nila, mas ma mas maliwanag and or uh, hindi masyadong mainit kasi walang covered court dito. Um, uh, and so it was scheduled at 8 a.m. So thank you very much, ma'am. Uh, maagang pala kayong nagigising. 7.30, nandito na pala kayo. Uh, palakpakan natin si Apo kayo. Um, it's good that uh, pinigyan tayo ng magandang panahon and uh, hindi umulan at maayos sa atin, uh, ating uh, turnover. I heard this uh, office during uh, rainy season, especially during these days, medyo baha. Pero pagtingin ko, parang wala, walang resem there's no resemblance of uh, flooding or whatsoever. Pinabaha ba talaga dito sa harapan? So, um, uh, malaking tulong ang magagawa ng ating mga local chief executive. Lalong-lalo na in the improvement of uh, our facilities. Specifically, uh, kung binabaha ito, and then, therefore, uh, medyo maayos natin. Um, uh, it is uh, the duty of each and everyone to uh, coordinate, collaborate, and uh, be with partners with our uh, local uh, executives, especially the uh, mayors, as well as the different uh, um, uh, the stakeholder, the stakeholders in the community. After all, peace and order is a shared commitment of uh, the police and the community. Nakalagay yun sa ating mission. Tama ba? Um, uh, the Philippine National Police shall uh, prevent and control crime, blah, 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 ensure public safety with coordination or partnership with the community. Tama ba? So, hindi lang tayo, laging tayo na sisisi. Sisisihin din natin ang ating mga stakeholders, lalong-lalo na ang ating uh, local government, headed by the uh, chief executive. Hindi sisi, but pupunta tayo sa kanila to help me and help her or help the uh, uh, local units, the government, to maintain peace and order and accomplish this uh, mission ng Philippine National Police, mission na rin yun ng uh, community. After all, ang sabi ng uh, nakalagay sa mission or uh, purpose, functions of uh, local, government, go local government units is the peace and tranquility of a, uh, an area leading to prosperity. Okay. And so, when this is my uh, first official visit here, um, uh, nagtataon pa na turnover and uh, I would like to uh, give my action plans and or sabihin na sa inyo uh, what are our priority plans? Our priority 
is of course gearing towards the accomplishment of your mission. Kaya kailangan dapat alam niyo yung mission niyo. This is the very Bible kung anong dapat gawin ng isang police. Okay? Yun, sinabi ko na. Coordination. Um, uh, with these uh, action plans that uh, I have already um, uh, introduced and or sinabi ko na with corresponding uh, directives, of course with me, is uh, the staff coming from the regional office, command group, the RTRDA, General Tomundo, our new chief of staff, uh, Uh, Colonel Octavio, and of course our uh, SRS, Colonel Padaios, and our R1, Colonel Pastor. I already uh, spread out and or level these action plans. And these action plans, of course, is uh, geared towards the accomplishment of our vision, the PNP, as well as um, uh, will give guidance to the uh, uh, adherence to the uh, focus agenda of our Chief Philippine National Police, the PCCAI. Ngayon, um, uh, personal, personal, moral, and welfare, um, uh, community engagement, aggressive law enforcement, um, uh, ICT development, and integrity enhancement. Tandaan nyo yun. And with my action plan, seven action plans, uh, we will be accomplishing it. I will not be introducing uh, Um, uh, the usual pagkabago ang, uh, ang uh, commander, may bagong slogan, may bagong tarpulid, so and so. Pinapatanggal ko na nga yung tarpulid and nobody would be posting tarpulids especially with my pictures. Okay? Lalong-lalo na pag ang tarpulid, hindi naman nakalagay sa billboard, set billboard, minsan ilagay lang sa puno, pinabayaan. Remember, yung isang tarpulid, it will take more than 50 years para matunaw. Okay? Of course, nakalagay pa yung bato, nakasapit, tapos nakalagay mineral water. Wala nang ganun. So, it's a useless uh, um, uh, posting. Simple things like that. Okay? Our Philippine National Police had been in existence for 32 years already. Okay? And I've been in the police service for 31 years. And we have already transformed. Imagine when I graduated in uh, 1992, ang sweldo nun is something like uh, not more than 3,000 gross. And I was assigned in uh, in Mindanao, in Western Mindanao, Basilan, Bolo, and the rest of uh, Mindanao. But ang, uh, ang uh, headquarters namin is in uh, Basilan. Together, of course, with uh, the new the new and the out, the outgoing the incoming gentlemen here um, uh, I've been with them especially in um, uh, Negros. During that time 3,000 ang aking uh, take home pay so 9,000 say 10,000 na lang in 3 months and the airfare during that time is about 6,000 tatanda ko back and forth and I will be left with 4,000 So, makakauwi ako na once in every quarter or once in every three months. But, I will be left with 4,000. Paano ako makakakain ko? Di, di, kakainin ko na yung MOE. No. So, the solution, hindi ako nakauwi for two Christmases because I'm still, I still have my brother na tinutulong ako na mapagpigyan. So, those are the things na nag-transform ngayon. Remember, the Integrated Transformation Program of the Philippine National Police. It is a conglomeration of all plans to transform the Philippine National Police. ITP ang tawag doon, okay? Naiintindihan pa? So, nagsimula yan. And one pressing uh, problem, challenge to transform the PNP is to increase yung salary and base right now patrolman 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 ikaw ano ang uh, gross gross uh, pay mo lakasan 38,000 okay 
Ma'am, pagkaya-asay natin si Patrolman Ber... Tagasangga? <coughs> Oo, oh, yung lawin yun. Ako, mas malayo ako ha. I'm from Santa. It's not Santa Cruz. Santa Ilocosur. Santa without sin. Mas malayo ako sa'yo. Um, we're about uh, two... Uh, I'm uh, two hours way north. If you're from uh, San Juan, La Union? San Fernando, dalawang oras ang diferensya natin. 38,000. Ngayon, meron na... Ito na ngayon, mababa na yung back and forth na air About five or eight na lang ako. You can go home monthly, leaving 30,000 naman. So that, so that is the difference. Um, uh, dati, I refuse to uh, have my issue, especially the uh, short firearms. <coughs> Kailangan lang naman, the long firearms at saka dun sa, sa special action forces, long firearms, basuka or uh, 90RR. Because nakahawa ko sa mga patrollers natin, sila na lang ang priority na ma-issuehan. Because during those times, The, uh, during those times, um, the uh, equipage ratio is something like, something like, uh, fill up lang mag 20% or less than. But now, it is already, um, uh, mahabot na natin yung 100%. Walang sasakyan, So on and so forth. At mabuti na lang, nandito ang ating mga butihing LGU, lalong-lalo na ang ating uh, uh, LGU or uh, the mayor of Malabon. Nagpapadunate at tumutulong sa Philippine National Police. Mabibigyan na naman tayo ng mga sasakyan. Okay, huwag naman yung uh, malalaki. Malalaki mga sasakyan or like for example, mga kataas or yung uh, highly mobile lang, perhaps, maybe I, I could recommend, um, uh, yung uh, malilit na makakapasok sa kalasada, ang sasakyan, including mga motor. Yun yung mga kailangan. As per operational data analysis, analysis. Ganun naman tayo mag-isip as commanders, di ba? So, palapakan natin. <laughs> ano yun na? Ang dalga may nabusap, uh, kingmate niya na eh. Actually. Thank you, ma'am. And so, Those are the efforts in the continuing integra uh, integrated transformation program at tuloy-tuloy yan. Okay? And so, maraming mga programa, including the operational plan that is badly needed in the Philippine National Police. I would like to start to each and everyone from uh, all level of uh, leaders, from district directors, the staff, at pababa. We must ensure to manage our uh, human, material, logistical. If you are, uh, if you can manage this properly, you are a good commander already. Yung uh, operational nandiyan na lahat. Tama ba mga personnel? Sir! Yes, kasi siyempre kailangan pabigyan kayo ng training, management of human material, human uh, resources yun and so on and so forth, answering the different performance indicator ng unit at napakarami nun. You will be subjected to physical and uh, mental health uh, incentives, rewards, and punishment. Kailangan natin yung punishment. Punishment is uh, here in NPD. Um, uh, last week, ang NPD personnel was figured out in a robbery in Tagupan. Tama po? Okay. Uh, please, I mean, uh, the case of robbery was found already and so therefore um, uh, ensure that the ensure that the administrative case ay umanda. At pipirmahan ko ka agad doon. Remember, yung chief of police of the district director um, uh, 7-15 yung 7 is under our disciplinary mechanism pwede na kayong mag uh, magbigay ng uh, kaparusahan 7 days and below while the district directors can 
uh, at the maximum of 15 days. Akya, sa akin, ang bilisan nyo. Please impose it. Kasi, dito pa lang sa level nyo, may enforce nyo na yan. Otherwise, pag hindi natin naayos yan, pagtatawanan tayo ng mga tao natin. And they will continue. Um, uh, in different uh, units, when I call, lagi ko ginagawa yan. And they call me Hitler. Bahala sila kung anong tawag itawag nila sa akin. Meron nga, Bertugo eh. Pero sa encounter naman yun, doon sa Central Zone. Banted ako doon sa sa CPP. Okay. But, I will not stop to those words. I uh, kinukuha ko na lang yun or pinapasa puso ko na lang that it is a challenge. Parang pader na lang yun na kahit kailangan ko ng tatawa. Okay? The number one problem, in, sinabi ko na kanina sa si integrate, uh, integrated uh, transformation is the discipline Bakit nagtakaganon ang pulis? Kasi mababa ang sweldo and we are ill-equipped and well, ill-trained. Naayos na natin ngayon. Tama ba? May paril na kayo. May paril na kayo, di ba? May mahaba, may maiksi. Sweldo na kayo ng mataas, di ba? Okay. So, in my 8 days or 10 days, uh, may hahatulan ako ng pito. Uh, of course, it will uh, do, it will be through due process. One figured in a uh, robbery in uh, Dagupan, one is figured in a uh, drinking and disturbance sa loob ng bar dun sa Montilupa, and one is uh, the group of five was figured in a robbery extortion in Sampalong, Manila. Lumabas na ngayon. So, DRDA, sir, help me with that together with my uh, art staff. I-dismiss natin itong mga polis na. Okay? And so, those are the things on uh, management of human, human uh, material and uh, financial resources. Oh, if the chief of police and the station commanders are here, the uh, different uh, funds are already downloaded sa inyo. Okay, through your ATMs. Uh, before, uh, you are directed to report to the national headquarters or to the regional headquarters or to provincial headquarters. No, to receive your uh, MOV. Ngayon, hindi na. Gagastos ka pa papunta nun or so. Hindi na. Naka-ATM na. Okay, utilizing our expanded modified disbursement scheme. Meaning, The funds is to sign partners bibili in goods. Dito kayo, kayo nang bibili. Less the usual clearing costs. Ito yung mga tactic, taxes, and of course yung mga... So yun mga mga ginagamit ng Philippine National Police. Uh, nagbago na po. Naka-ATM lang e buhay natin. And for sure, dapat alam nyo, you should account this sa uh, MOV. Iba-iba po ang MOV niya. Meron yung regular MOV, meron silang Funds for PUPCs, COP, COP station. Anong station yan? Okay, so, meron kayong PUPC, ha? Okay, meron kayong LCA, meron kayong PADS, meron kayong ISO, PADS, Police or uh, Philippine Anti-Drug Strategy Funds. Okay? Meron din kayo, bumabalik sa inyo yung National Police Clearance. Funds, bumabalik din. Baka hindi nyo nagubil ang tinta nyo rin. You should account for it. Kaya nga, every turnover, may sinasabi, turning over of the property book, I will utilize it, account it. Utilize it properly and account it. So that we should pay help. Comfortable. Okay? Sit down. Dati, ma'am, araw. CRD, mamimigay ng ng uh, 
Pegas, Pugas in uh, Bisaya. Pagpunta niya kay uh, provincial director or kay district director, Alangati. Pagpunta ni pag-download ng uh, Pugas, Pugas, sa station, one port na. Doon sa substation, wala nang laman. Kaya, ano sabi ng substation commander? Ay, nagpadala si R.D. ng sako. Nagagyan niya ngayon na bigas. The denial of occurrence of prevalent crimes, especially focus crimes, yung eight focus crimes, or ito yung index crimes. The usual cases of these cases are committed on the streets. Deny. How to deny? Okay, bago ma-deny or uh, after denial is we identify the bagong uh, district director. We ensure investigative solution within every case. Wala na yung mga table investigations yung so depende kung gaano kahirap. You can not have pursuit to those identified personality involved in these crimes kung pwede pang mulihin and produce, secure the necessary evidences so that they will be charged in court on inquest. Okay? Doon sa kalabarsoon we have, lalo-lalo na when there uh, is a case of uh, robbery with homicide, in Las Marinas, after seven days, utilizing all the resources in the BDPPO, kuha. Kasi ngayon, ayaw na nilang maghahat puso eh. Natatakot na eh. Huwag kayong magalala. Bibigyan namin kayo ng uh, abogato. Yung mga COB, huwag kayong matakot. Nandyan si Mayor. Marami abogato si Mayor. Tutulungan kayo. Okay? So, yun lang, if you can produce, or uh, our district, or uh, our uh, officers can produce a good operational plan, or a good uh, plan to address this in focus crimes, eh, gawin nyo. Okay, you introduce, you can do it, but as of now, kung wala, we will be employing management, police, operation, or the local city. Deny the occurrence of crime dahil sa magandang pagpapatulya. Investiga doon sa mga identified. Sila-sila lang yan eh. May nalakawan dyan. Sila-sila lang yan. Kung kayo nagpapatulya, okay? Ang operation. Uh, the good patrolling, good intelligence, good investigation, and then samahan mo ng intelligence and good PCR. Yun na yan eh. Yung kuman, yung kuwan. Mahuhuli nyo yan. Sabi ng ating uh, new district director, come on the days na kilala yung polis sa kalsada ni mamang polis ni General Razon. Wala na yun. Why? Kaya nga sinabi ko is we engage ourselves, especially the chief of police, yung community. Okay. So let's go back to EMP. Ganun lang kasimple ang EMP. We've been doing that before, together with the, our districts. Very effective, especially in, deni in the denial of uh, horrors of crime and of course, arrest of those personalities in Boulder. Okay, so General Gapas, please uh, continue what uh, um, uh, ongoing uh, Director of the has done. Here in Kilamit uh, Kilamit 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 So, side by side with that is our campaign on illegal drugs, um, uh, campaign on terrorism as well as campaign on uh, loose fight arms. Those are the denominators of uh, our focus crimes. Lahat ng mga nag-rape at nag-knockout, usually they are in the use of drugs and usually with the use of fight arms. So, kailangan aggressive tayo doon. Terrorism, because uh, we are in the Metro Manila, kailangan-kailangan natin uh, bantayan. 
even though the Metro Manila is a uh, uh, low low uh, threat level, but the highest security level dito sa Metro Manila is three highest. Okay? So, third job. Uh, fourth pala, P, P46 is uh, we review, revisit our uh, uh, security on vital installations. Yun, ulitin ko ulit. Kung pulis ka, dapat alam mo kung ilang bangko at sino ang kakausapin dun sa bangko. May number kayo. Ilan ang factory? Si mayor ba may threat? Ilan ang local government units? Saan ang bahay nila? Yun yun. Security on vital installations and other areas of concerns. Pinunsida na natin yung EG. EG. And of course, our uh, to review, revisit security and management of all activities, whether recurring or not, national, local, or international. From day 1, January 1 to 31. Taon-taon na lang natin ginagawa. Di ba taon-taon mayroong November 1? Oplan, kaluluwa ba yun? Kaluluwa. Yung mga ginawa yung initiatives. Ayusin nyo na para mabago yung plan. And that is the correct way of planning. No? Alam na natin eh, nakakalendar na yun. And so, ngayon pa lang, ayusin na natin, especially this staff and the district uh, director. No? Ang pag-revisa, uh, ang pag is matter of doing it before para maayos ng pre-prepare na kayo. Like for instance, what? Election. Comes August 30. Um, uh, no, October 30. Our SONA. Taon-taon na lang yun may SONA. And so I expect everyone, especially uh, General Gapas here at Northern Police District, we are, as a National Capital Region, we have the task force on uh, SONA. We ensure um, uh, that SONA will be delivered by our uh, dear uh, PPBM on uh, July 24. And you have your uh, activities already here in Northern uh, Police District area. Meron kayong uh, set for na binigay na mga um, uh, activities. And continuously identify the different risk factors so that ma-address natin um, uh, mapatupad yung uh, or ma-isakawa ma ang raso ng ating uh, presidente. When we talk about planning, of course, yung planning natin ay uh, di ba, Father? Father, planning. Taken from uh, the Bible Scripture, Proverbs 21. Planning and good work will lead us to prosperity while hasty uh, and shortcuts will lead us to pain. So, yun lang yun. Mas pagandang may plano tayo. Say sa wala and with that action plan and or uh, action plan mm, incoming uh, or uh, the new district director and as well as uh, our uh, chief of police sundin natin yan. Okay? So, sa itong mga bata, I would like to uh, thank each and every one, especially the Northern Police District again. For uh, the work right now that I have, uh, that you have uh, given to me, along with my rival owner, this is uh, my official uh, visit here in uh, Northern Police District. Thank you very much at the uh, preparation you know, um, to our uh, mayor. Thank you, ma'am, for uh, raising this uh, period. Um, uh, we will not say goodbye to uh, the outgoing, but uh, kasi it's very hard to say goodbye, but uh, perhaps we will see him again. Okay, so 
thank you ma'am for uh, sharing your time today and uh, of course uh, uh, congratulations for uh, a job well done here in uh, Northern Police District uh, Brigadier General Peñones <laughs> Police uh, Risalino, Brigadier General Risalino Gapas, uh, carrying on the uh, good work and uh, of course good luck. Okay, para pangalan natin sa mga